All right. I was originally gonna do this yesterday, but now we're doing it today. Oh no, there goes my controller, I dropped it. Hello, chat. Hello. White Fire, thank you for the tier one. I appreciate it. More Odyssey streams, yeah. Right now I am currently waiting for the mod to install into my Switch because I I had it installed yesterday, but then last minute Small was like, hey, you wanna <laughs> you wanna um play the randomizer? So yeah. Well, other than that, I think everything is ready. Uh, there's one main custom kingdom I wanted to do today, but I might do some of the other ones that are on uh, Game Banana that I haven't really tried before. Because there's a, there's a few on there um, that we could give a look. Because there's a few, like... Um, ones that should be small or some like i think there's one that i doesn't even have any moons in it but i'd still like to look at it um but yeah this first this first mod we do i might make a video on because it looks really cool it looks really cool What do I think of CJ didn't copy chat more than one person can have blonde hair. Did you know that? <laughs> Isn't that crazy? Yeah, I'm just I'm just waiting for the the mod to install right now. You want know, the fur plus video? Nice. Shoutouts to me actually uploading to the VOD channel. Is it installed yet? No, it's like a half a gig file, so. Takes a little bit. Yeah, I think I think this will be this will be cool. I'm excited. Might not be the longest stream today, but I think this will be Fun. I don't know how long it's gonna take me to beat the mod. It has 33 moons in it, so. Also, the game might crash. Oh, is it done? Okay. Yeah, the stream will probably be a lot shorter than yesterday. Super Mario Odyssey! It's gonna be a video, maybe. <clears throat> All right, we should load right into the kingdom when I load this. Oh, 
Okay. Did my game cry? Oh! One second, chat. I gotta be Mario. <laughs> Actually, we could be... Cowboy would fit because of the, the theme of the kingdom. We're gonna be Cowboy. And here we are. Oh, this is so cool. So this is Bon Bones Mountain, um, a custom stage made by Skydorm One. Um, I saw I saw this got made recently, and I really wanted to try it out. Let me let me double check real quick that hopefully moons work. Dude, that shop door is so big. I might need a... Okay. One of the moons is a shop moon. So that's our that's our first moon, easy. There's like 33 of them in the mod. So yeah, but like, look at this. This is so like crazy. Like, I, I don't think I've really seen a custom map that's, like, this impressive looking before. <laughs> Get a Moai. Can I do anything with this? Is there anything I'm, like, missing? Or is he just, like, here because he can be? Oh, there's a moon up there. Um. Oh, what can you do? You may have heard, you're quite the celebrity here. My name is Nick. I was the one who did a backflip. Looking back, that probably wasn't... Oh, he he died because he did a backflip. Probably would have died anyways. The train wouldn't be leaving any... Won't be leaving anytime soon. I came to the city to start a research station. I also once sent a toad up the mountain to do some observations. He hasn't reported back to me yet, though. I wonder if the little one is okay. Thank you, sir. It was a pleasure to chat with you. I'd love to give you something for it, but I lost my moon in the water and couldn't find it. Oh, so there's a moon in the water. Okay. Also, I don't know if the no music is a bug or not, so I'm going to turn on my own music chat. Sound good? Sounds good. It's gonna be a little quiet, but that's fine. I feel like we need to write down the lore. I mean, I don't know if we need to write it down. We just need to know that there's a moon somewhere in the water. Somewhere in here. Oh, there's like a broken pipe. That's actually pretty cool. All right, is there, is there a moon down here? Maybe, maybe they meant behind the waterfall. Ooh, it's a bit laggy. It's fine. Okay. So this is definitely a little laggy, but we're gonna climb out. All right. I need to. I think I need to have the camera this way so the game doesn't lag. Oh no, it still lags. That's fine. Yeah, just a tiny bit. I, I heard there was lag. Unless you played on emulator. So we're just gonna deal with it because I can't play an emulator. All right, we're up. Ooh, is that a moon? Nice. All right, that's our first moon. How do I get up there though? That's what I wonder. Wait, is that a breakable rock? No, it's not. All right, 
point. I really want to figure out how to get up there. Sir Spinks question. Greeting traveler into your hat as well. Can you answer my riddle? What is the name of this island? Bon Bones Mountain. Nice. Ooh, we got a moon down here maybe? Let's go. Ow, I, I bogged on the steps. Okay. Uh, are there more questions maybe? All right, let us see how you do with this one. How long are you already staying here? Uh, I, I don't know. Since I'm staying here? No, that's wrong. How am I supposed to know this? How am I supposed to know how long he's been here? You're not standing? Okay, apparently that was the answer. What is the motto of this wretched town? Uh, if I were to guess, down to the bone. Okay. Saving this one, answer me this. What is the name of Tubba Blubba's key? Is that from Paper Mario? Is that even... I don't know, Yaki? That has key in it. Okay. I, I did play it, but I didn't remember. I got a lucky guess. All right. Uh, last question. Why are you here? Um... <laughs> <laughs> your decoration no I was wrong I hope it's not to die alone that would be sad oh alright he's here for filler love to see it I love filler in my SMO custom levels alright Wait, I just realized these are <laughs> these aren't normally an enemy in SMO. <laughs> the little the little ant guys. Look at them. All right, is there anything on the train? Oh. All right, this is actually really cool. When you're in the train, the top disappears so you can see. I maybe I'm maybe I'm a bit easily amused here, but I really like that. It's like I, I really feel like I'm in the train. Ooh, there's a there's a moon pipe in there. I think that I think that's one of the Ooh. Wait, is that on the train? Oh, it's in one of the boxes. Can I break these? Oh, there's a hole in the box. Okay. Well, I kind of cheated to find that moon, but that's fine. Feels a little tight in here. Oh, that's fine. What do you have to say? It's too bad a rockfall blocks the train route. I was looking forward to take a ride on the Star Express. You just love this train and the branches are so comfortable. Nice. All right. I wonder if, like, it's a moon to, like, break the... Well, actually, I don't see any rocks to break. It just leads into a into a gap. Or, like, you know, a, a dead end. Wait, can I go in here? Can I go in the... I can, but I can't really see anything. This model looks cool. It's really cool. I'm pretty sure this is the train from Captain Toad. I think you're right. I think you're right about that. It fits really well. All right, I can't help but like, I wanna go out here. I don't think there's anything out here, but I have to. Uh-oh. No, come back, Mario. Another mod maker to commission from. Apparently there's like 250 hours of work in this mod and that is out of my budget. <laughs> I, t I can't, I can't afford to hire somebody for that much work. All right, I wanna, I still wanna make it to the end of the, um, 
of the track. I feel like there might be a ground pound moon out there. So we just gotta make every jump. No, there's not. <laughs> I did all that for nothing. That's fine. It's floating island. Can, I, I don't know if I can jump over to that, though. I think, I think that's for later. Like, maybe there's, like, a pipe or something that brings me over there. I don't know. There's, there's so much. Oh, gosh. Ow. Well, that's another death. All right. Let's see. I don't want to go on the moon pipe yet. Let's uh, let's start going up this way. Uh, ooh, do these do anything, or are they just decoration? Right, I think I think they're just decoration. I like the little crack in the ground. There's so much like detail everywhere. It's so impressive. All right, let's let's uh, let's start climbing up here. All right, it looks like we have some seeds and a turnip, okay. So I'm gonna turn down the music just a little bit so I can hear the game better. Sorry if that makes it really quiet on your end, guys. All right, so I'm assuming I need to take the seed somewhere, but I don't know where yet. You got like little gold pots and stuff. Ow. All right, well, that's clearly a moon. I still don't know what to do with this. Um, I might just worry about it later. Let's let's see what the notes do. Okay. Oh God, I gotta be careful. I'm gonna... No, I hit the cactus. I needed to be more careful. Now I gotta climb all the way back up there. Also, guys, stop backseating. You should have uh, you should have learned this after yesterday. All right, let's get back up. All right, I want to do I want to do the notes moon. I think now that I have full health, this will be a bit easier because I can run into the dry bones now. There we go. Easy. Oh, wait, I have to go back to the moon. That's fine. It's not that far. Okay. I feel like one of these turnips has to be, like, a golden one. Because there was a soup pot down, like, by the town. But it doesn't look like any of these ones are. Um, did I check this one? Okay, yeah, check that one. All right, I don't, I don't think any of these turnips are the right thing we're looking for. Oh, but this one, maybe. Yeah, there we go. Okay. We found, we found the turnip moon. I just gotta bring it back to the pot. Awesome. Gosh, this is this is such a cool level. Time for Beat Soup 2? Wait, is there a is there a first one? Oh my game's in <laughs> I can't, I, can't, I kinda can't read the uh whatever, it's fine. Hey dude, you up for a challenge? Everybody loves walking. Problem is most people don't say Oh, we got a trace walking moon? I'll do a trace walking moon. 
Alright. I think I think this is a good circle. I think I'm doing it well. Oh, easy hundred. Love that. All right. Uh, I think there's two trace walking moons and in... yeah, 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 yeah. So we got to do this again. Get a second moon. Ninety-seven. All right, not bad. Koopa's walk, so true. You know, just gotta check the crates just in case. I still don't know what the moai is for. I haven't, I haven't noticed anything with it. Um. Oh, there's a back door to the shop. Is there anything in here? Oh, it's it's just another way into the shop. That's funny. Alright, uh more turnips. We still need to find a second uh, turnip that's golden. Um. Oh, there it is. All right. Easy. We're making good progress so far. We're almost at. We're almost. We're at ten moons. Uh, do you tell me how many you need, Mari? You have to help me. I'm missing three radishes, so we need one more. Okay. Uh, let's go back over here and do the uh, the timer challenge. Okay. I like these platforms. Uh. Come on. Um. Uh, oh. I thought I had to jump on the thwomp. Uh, all right, let's try that again. We were almost there. I love the details in this map. It's so cool. All right, take me up. Let's go! Climbing Expert Toad. Mario, good to see you. I saw creatures crawling out of this pipe. Maybe you should follow them and take a look. All right, I think that's one of the other areas because there's there's like three or two sub areas. I, I think it's three. Um, let me double check. Yeah, there's three sub areas in the map, and I want to do those after I get all the moons in this area. So we'll we'll be back up here. I don't want to I don't want to go in there yet. But good to know we 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 know where two of the sub areas are, which is good. All right, let's start climbing back up the mountain. I really want to see what's up here. We still don't know what the uh the nuts do. All right. Just make my way up. It's a little laggy, but that's fine. Okay. Ooh, this area is really pretty. Look at this. Oh no, I think I think it crashed. <laughs> That's fine. I I knew this is something that would probably happen. So, um we'll just reload it. And if I make a video, we can just edit around it.
Or we can, or we can keep the crash in the edit. <laughs> this is pretty. Dies. Yeah, dies immediately. back in yeah i'm not doing a crash counter chat that's a that's a way to be super disrespectful to the person who made the mod i'm not doing that all right let's get back up there Also, chat, remember, since the game crashed, we have 11 moves. We have 11 moves. I l <laughs> no, it crashed again. I might need to be careful up here. I, I don't know if there's a way I can avoid it or not. Uh, let's see. I admittedly tried to get this working on my Switch Pro because I knew there would be a little bit of issues with it on console. But uh, I'm we're gonna try and work around the uh, the crash issues. Write a crash report to the mod creator after stream. Uh, I think they're I think they're aware that it's laggy on Switch. Uh, Bongo man, thank you for the hundred bits. I appreciate it. Well, there's a lot of reasons of what it may be. I'm not gonna. We're not gonna fixate on it. I just want to see if I can get up there without it crashing. Super Mario Odyssey! Well, the reason I knew there were crashes is because people made comments on the post. Um saying that so they're they're aware i'm not going to be another person being like hey this crashes sometimes because <laughs> i'm sure they know We're going to try and get back up there again. Um, if it crashes, I'll try and get up there a different way or like do camera shenanigans. And am I going to make this into a video? Maybe. I want to. It really just depends on how the whole thing goes and how hard it is to work around like crashes and lag. Because I think it's a really cool mod and I would love to make a video on it but it'll really just depend on, uh, you know, flag and stuff. All right, we are back up here. I'm gonna be a bit careful because it's a bit laggy up here. <laughs> uh, I don't want it to crash again. No! I think it is Peach.
Because it's every time Peach is on the screen. Here, let me let me do something really quick. Uh, there's a chance I something didn't install fully. Meaning like Peach is missing her dialogue. And it's trying to show the dialogue, and that's what crash that's what crashing it. Um So give me one second, I'm gonna reinstall the mod. I can also try a different version of the mod, which will have a different crash, but we'll see. Yeah, we're just gonna we're just gonna give this another try real quick. Uh, do a fresh install. Because yeah, I think it's I think it's Peach dialogue. I guess there's a chance it's my save file too. Uh, so here, we'll do two things. We'll do that, and then we're gonna reinstall the mod. giving him a longer time out for that um am i gonna do a stream reviewing the tears of the kingdom trailer no i don't think i have anything to add that like people who know a lot about tears of the kingdom could add yeah let's try um i'm currently reinstalling the mod chat it's gonna take a moment so while that's happening how are you doing today What was the modding thing? Uh, I restored an older version of my save file. Like there's a chance if something weird is in my save file, it'll, this will help. Can I delete the mod command? Oh yeah, cause the mod command, you, you guys should be using the current command. Thank you. The current command is the one in the title. Because I, I, there's like a couple other custom stages I just want to take a quick look at after this one. Though, if one gets made into a video, it will be this one. Because I think this is like... It's such a cool mod. I know we're having a little bit of issues with it, but it's so cool. ba da da ba 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 da ba ba da ba 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 having a nice day hey you too you too also i guess if i open if i upload this to the vod channel i should probably try and remember to remove the crash part <laughs> like right now i guess i don't have to there's no obligation for me to remove this part of the vod for the vod channel upload i play the randomizer again uh small never invites me to play it again sure This is the best custom kingdom you've ever seen. It's so cool. I saw, I was looking on Game Banana because I was working on the the next viewer ideas video because there was a mod I remembered that fit one of the viewer ideas that somebody already made. 
And then I saw this custom kingdom and I was like, oh my God, I want to play this because <laughs> it looks so cool. It's like when I found out about Autumn Isles, I was like, oh my God, I want to play this. Because Autumn Isles is one of the best custom map mods I've played. Um, like aesthetically, it's a lot simpler than this mod, but it's Autumn Isles is an incredible, like a really, really good mod. Um, yeah, this is also incredible and really good and really cool looking. Like, again, there are three sub-areas, and the sub-areas look really cool. We just gotta get past the crashing, and then there's, like, 33 moons, and it's just a cool mod. Yeah, I hope we, I hope we can figure out the peach crash. You gonna be streaming tomorrow? Probably. I think tomorrow I might try and record for the 2D mod. Where we do the min 2D run. So it'll be like, so like today's a stream that I'm more focused on like how it will look for YouTube and tomorrow's stream might be the same thing. What time? I usually start five Eastern, so. All right, chat. I don't know how close it is to finishing, but it's getting there. How am I today? I'm doing all right. Uh, I don't really want to do much while it's downloading because I don't want to risk like if the mod did install incorrectly and that's why Peach is crashing. Um, yeah, I don't want it to mess up. This might be a video. And if this crashes, I might try one of the older versions of the mod. Because the, the issue with the older version of the mod is that if you went into like multiple sub areas in one playthrough, it would crash. Um, so we could just reload in that case, which is easy to do. Do other mods in store if this doesn't work? If this doesn't work, we'll just avoid that section of the map. Because I, I, again, we, we think it's Peach, so. All right, it looks like all the files are transferred. Let's see if it crashes this time. Yeah, I could have tried to avoid looking at Peach. <laughs> I mean, that might be what we do, because I'm pretty sure there's a moon up there. One tiny part of the kingdom. Yeah, but it looks so cool. <laughs> like, I want to go up there.
All right, we are back. Let's try this again. Wait, I gotta, I gotta go back to cowboy outfit check. Cowboy outfit, cowboy outfit, cowboy outfit. All right. Let's get back up there. No! <laughs> see if Peach crashes it again, if I get too close to Peach. Okay, yeah, I think it's, I think it's a text bubble above Peach that crashes the game, so we just can't go towards Peach. It's 100% Peach. Yeah, well, we, she probably has a moon, so we're just not going to count that one. So we're going for 32 moons instead. So we're looking for 18 moons in the main area. We already have 11. So we need seven more moons. in my outfit i'll probably do a quick save too just so i don't have to put the outfit on again if i get too close to peach Thank you for the prime. I appreciate it. No. Gosh dang it, now I have to climb back up again. <laughs> Stop it, Mario. Oh, 
All right, we are finally back up here and we have determined that it is very likely Peach over there that crashes the game. So I need to not get to Peach. I need to not get too close to Peach or else the game is just gonna crash. And I think there's a moon up here. So I gotta, you know, let's just do that. Just keep Peach out of view or we can, we can just, uh, Observe Peach from afar, but we can't get too close. Gosh, this area is so cool, though. I love it so much. All right. Um, so there is a above the clouds thing up here. I'm assuming it's for the third sub area. So we're going to come back to this after we get all the uh, all the moons in this area that we haven't gotten yet. Um, which I think I know how to get. Oh, there's one way up there. What the heck? How am I supposed to get that? Is this another moon? Let's go. I love the I love the details up here. It's so cool. Like it's just there's so many cool details in this custom map. I love this so much. Oh, I, f I may have found out of bounds. Um, don't tell don't tell the mod maker. <laughs> don't tell the mod maker. I found the I found the hole. How do I get that? That's so that's so high up. All right, well, we'll, we'll worry about that later. Um, I think if we take one of these dry bones, we can get over to the floating islands on this side. Yeah. Oh, this is just so cool. They like move too. <gasps> Is that bench friends? <gasps> oh. <laughs> That's, I'm, so, I'm so disappointed. <laughs> All right, um, there's a lady Goomba here. What the hell? Is there a Goomba out here somewhere? There's also another moon up here. Oh, no, am I stuck? I uncaptured the dry bones. I didn't think this through. You think the Goomba died? Yeah, it might have. It might have walked off. Um... Here, we'll come we'll come back over here. Um, I'm gonna is there anything like in the trees? Yeah, here, we'll come we'll come back over. I think it I think it walked off on our way over there. Or there's like another way to get a Goomba over there. But I, I don't, how would you do that? Like, there might be something I'm missing. Oh, there's also a chance one of these could have a moon. Didn't think about that. No, okay. Moai? Oh, that's a good point. Maybe there's like an invisible path over there. We haven't we haven't seen anything the Moai's done yet. That's actually that's actually really smart. That could be it. No, I I don't see any invisible platforms. Maybe I'm not close enough though. No harm in like bringing them all the way over here. Oh, 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 chat, you're a genius. Here, I'm gonna, I'm gonna walk the Goomba over. 
You guys are so smart. I, I would have never thought of this. But that makes so much more sense. All right, once he's on like this path, we can capture him because we just know it's a straight line now. But this is like really intimidating. Just walking on an invisible path. Oh wait, is there? Uh, come back, Moai. There might be. <laughs> I am. Um, we're not done. Oh, there's an invisible path that way too. Okay. Come on, Goomba. Come on. You see me? All right, now we capture him. No, 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 be careful. I don't want to accidentally kill him. That'd be bad. There we go. Okay. That's cool. I would have never thought of that. Oh, does the bench show where the invisible platform is? I guess kind of. This is a very precarious path. All right. You're up to 15 moons. Um, counting the moons we got before the game crashed. So we are currently looking for um, three more moons. And we know where one of them is. Wait, is this is this a turn up? Oh, okay, this is one of them. But um, I might be a little nervous walking this back. Here, let's just let's just throw it, throw it, and then pick up the moai. I think we got to do this in like steps. Uh, whoops. <laughs> All right, let's try this again. No, don't fall, don't fall, don't. No, no. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. Uh. Okay, um, we can walk over to where Cappy was. Uh. Uh. No! <laughs> Oh, well, I'm gonna die. Gosh dang it. Oh, okay. That's fine. Let's get the Moai back. Also, we should check if the Moai shows how to get that, like, really high up moon. Uh, I'm gonna walk a bit closer in and look because it might not like load in until we're close enough. Oh, the Moai can't go up the steps. Uh, how do I get over there with the Moai? Probably just this way again. Okay, let's see. Is there anything over here? Oh, there's invisible blocks. Okay. Um, we'll get this moon real quick since we know how to get it, and then we'll go back to the turnip. Now. Okay. This is a bit annoying to climb, but we did figure it out. Oh no, the game crashed again. I <laughs> Ignore that one. 
There's a little bit of stability issues, but it's fine. Chat, do you know what block that was? Because it might be there's just not something in the block and the game crashed. Ignore what? Exactly. Like, I think that'll happen again. Fourth, I think. Okay. Yeah, so we'll try. We'll make sure we don't hit the fourth. Bum, 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 bum. Six streams open. Nice. Sounds like me. Super Mario Odyssey! Song is good? Agreed. One, two, three. How close are we to the moon? Uh, we should be able to jump to that. No, I hit the I hit the box again. Okay, yeah, it's the box the box crashes it. Edge of Crafts on the fourth block. Uh, with the experience I have testing SMO custom stages for videos, uh, the block probably doesn't have anything in it. So when you hit it, uh, there's nothing for the game to put out. So yeah, we can definitely get the moon. I just need to be careful. And it'll, the way that I, I in my head, I might edit this video myself. I might give it to my editor. I don't know. But the way in my head that this will probably work is the first crash will be in for Peach and the first crash will be in for the block so people understand why the moons disappear and other stuff like that. And then it'll cut to like where I actually get the moon. So my editor, uh, Mike, does a lot of the highlight editing. What might the video release? I don't know. Um, we'll see. Because I have a lot of stuff coming up. But the next video that should be uploaded on my channel is Manhunt. Uh, hopefully that'll be done by the end of the week. Yeah, it may or may not be a video. It really, it really just depends on how I feel after the stream is done and how many issues with like crashes and lag there is. All right. I should be able to get the, the moon uh, without hitting the block and that should avoid the crash. But I think I, I think I just need to do like a weird long jump or something like that. There we go. Easy. All right, now that we got that, let's go back to getting that third turn up. Uh, where was the Moai again? Oh yeah, back here, back here. Come here, Moai.
Oh yeah, I can't. I, I always forget I can't walk up those steps with this guy. Alright, here's the invisible path. We need to make sure the Moai does not fall this time. Are you stuck? Please don't tell me you're stuck. Okay, we're good. Alright, throw that. Capture the Moai. Uh, I can probably give it like one big throw again. No, it, I bounced it off the Moai. Alright, this is, this is harder than you would think. I know it doesn't look hard, but I promise it is hard. Like, you, you guys just gotta trust me. No, 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 no. Okay. We got that. Alright, here's my plan. I'm gonna put the Moai where the turn is. Uncapture. We're gonna grab the turn up and then run it over. Oh, okay, that was close. All right, I think we do something similar-ish again. Okay. And again. All right, we should be good to just walk it. All right, we did it. That was that was so much harder than it needed to be. Oh, there we go. Turn up number three. All right. There should be one more moon. Uh, and we did get a hint earlier that there'd be a moon somewhere like down here. Ooh, okay. Ooh, look at this. I like this cute little area. You can even see off the edge. Well, that's where the that's where the broken pipe went. All right, that should be that should be every moon in the main area. But there's still three sub areas left, and they all have like five moons each. So we st we're only like halfway through the mod, which is crazy. So chat, I'm gonna ask you a question. Do you want me to go to the sub area in the train, the one on the mountain, or the one up there in the like garden? Which one do you guys want? Train? All right, we're getting a lot of trains. Let's go. Let's go to the one in the train. We can do this one first. Okay. Let's see where it takes us. Yo, look at this. Look at this. That's, oh, this area, this is so cool. How many moons are, are in this one? Uh, I think it's four or five. So we'll just, oh, it makes me roll on these. All right, so we're looking for four or five moons here. <laughs> I honestly love this. Like the fact that I have to roll going, Ow. The fact that I like have to roll on these, does it does it force me to roll on like these ones too? Well, we gotta try. It does. Okay. I'll do and we get to go like up and then back down. I love it. That's so cute. All right, it looks like this is the first moon. Uh, I think the moons are already collected because of a bug with my save file, but we, we got one, we got one. So we're looking for three or four more. I don't know how many. Uh, we went down the blue path. Let's go down this path next, the cloud path. Ooh, 
Ooh, is there something? No? Just a... I mean, it's so cute. I like the little cave. Ooh, secret coins! Ow! <laughs> I missed all of them. Alright, there's gotta be, like, at least a... Oh! Oh, I thought that was gonna be a moon. <laughs> I did. I do see the switch though, so I think, I think our goal here is to uh, get eight Goombas stacked up. So let's do that. Hopefully, I didn't kill any. I might have. Yeah, I think I might have. Oh, there's one. We're up to four. Yeah, I have a feeling I killed some when I wasn't supposed to. <laughs> uh, whoops. All right, we'll 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 we'll, we'll come back here. <laughs> I'll come back here after I die or something. Let's just go down the green path for now, and then we'll come back down to the other path. All right, we get our second boot in the area. Nice. Slide two. All right, and then we're gonna take the yellow slide over that way. And then we'll, we'll figure out the Goombas after that. I think that's a good idea. Oh, there's more Goombas over here. Maybe I have to like bring them over. That would make the most sense. Cause there's like a ton over here. I like this little lake. Is there, a, is there a moon down here? Hiding? No, okay. Feel like I'm being taunted. It was just a coin in the box. Um, maybe up here. There's a bird there. Now the bird's there just for aesthetics, I guess. Oh, a secret. Dude, I love custom- and the moon! We found it, okay. Hide and seek, I'm, a, I'm familiar with that. All right, I don't, I don't think there's anything hidden back there. All right, now the question is, is there another moon on this island? I don't, I, I don't think there is. I think, I think all we need left is the Goomba, would be my guess. I'll look around a bit more. Uh, is there anything back here? No, do not jump off and die. Yeah, I don't I don't think there's another moon on this island. I think all that we have left is the uh the Goomba stack. I'm just making one last look around. Is there anything like up in the sky? No. Alright, let's 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 start getting Goombas. Four. We want eight. Five, six, seven, 
eight. All right, hopefully I can bring him down this. Yes, I can, okay. God, this area is so cool. All right, this part's gonna be a bit scary. <laughs> Gotta be careful not to lose my Goomba stack. Oh, come on, don't push me, don't push me. All right, we're good. I have one health. I might be killed by my other Goomba stack. That would be bad. Come on. Oh no, it's all the way over there. <laughs> You're kidding me. This is fine. I can make it back there without dying. I'm good at video games. Oh no, there's little guys in here. Be careful. And we got it. All right, I think, I think that is all the moons in the area. Now I just gotta figure out how to get back and probably just roll back. Or I have a better idea. Just, just jump off. <laughs> that works, right? Oh, I, I <laughs> ignore that. That didn't happen. All right, on to the next sub area. Um, I think we're gonna do the one by Peach next. I think we're gonna do that one next. So we gotta bring the nut up there. Come on, and stop falling, Mario, please. Please, Mario. Also, I'm gonna be so upset if I crash the game again. This might actually be hard to get the seat up there. Ow. Especially with the lag, but I can I can do it. No, I it fell. I know there's a um there's one up here, but if I I'll be too close to Peach, I think, if I hit it. I think we need to do this the hard way. Yeah, that is that is too close to Peach. Alright. We're doing it the hard way, chat. Yeah, we're pretty sure Peach causes a crash. Yeah. 
Oh, this is gonna be annoying. I gotta get the seat up there. No, the Valu dive, the teched up. I hate this game sometimes. Here, I'm gonna turn the video back on. Well, this, I might not even show this part in the video. I might just cut straight to the next area, because, you know. The only reason this is hard is because of the crash. <laughs> Do another. No, you're kidding me. It like fell when I got close to it. Why is it laggy? Uh, it's just a bit of a laggy mod sometimes. Like, there's a lot going on in the mod. That dry bones is getting annoying. Threw it too far. It's falling, it's falling, it's falling. Grab it, grab it, grab it. No! I was so close! It's like one of the last ones. So I'm knocking this guy off. Heck him. And I fell. Hecked up. was close. I'm 
Well, that one I guess I have to be more careful on because it's... I just bounced it off. All right, we're going to get it, though. I've, I've gotten better at it, clearly. Gosh dang it. I'm gonna get it. kidding me that is so unfair if i moved during the ground pound because the nuts so big i got scammed on that one Valu dives so much. Gosh dang it. Here, can I... Let me try something. Alright, that's what we're doing for that part. And then here, we're gonna do the same thing. Yeah. Okay. Once we get to this one again, uh, we'll be able to clear it probably. I was overthinking it when I was trying to throw it on the last one. Fell off again. Oh, 
Dude, you're kidding. I hate how big the nut is because it pushes you around when you ground pound. <laughs> That's so obnoxious. Chat, this isn't even, this isn't even meant to be a, a part of the, uh, the, like a challenge of the mod. It's just there's a small bug. I don't know if it only happens on console or not. Or if you walk towards Peach, the game crashes. And there there's a nut at the top. But it's too close to Peach, so I can't get it. See if I can get it. I don't want to reopen the game like a fifth time. It's I, I looked at it. It is it is definitely too close to Peach. Like it might even be somewhat of a challenge when I get up there to make sure I can actually throw the nut in the pot without getting too close to Peach. Just keep her off screen. It's not that simple. It is time for sub area number two. Okay, uh, I don't really know what's going on here yet. Oh, this is cool. Can I, I can stand on this. Whoa, look at this. That's crazy, what? This is insane. Like this is, <laughs> this is an SMO mod. All right, first we gotta we gotta figure out what's down here. Anything? I guess not. Okay. Maybe a moon spawns down there. We are on our way up. This is so cool. Oh, there's something over there. There's stuff like everywhere. Here, let, let's get the let's get the flying Goomba. Oh, there's moon shards. Okay. Uh, is there one up there? Uh, I should be able to make this jump. Yeah, what does this do? Nothing. Unless there's like a node smooth or so. Whoa! Okay, um, <laughs> good thing I ground-pounded. 
Maybe there, I, I feel like there has to be a notes moon. Like we're gonna get to the top and there's gonna be a, a notes moon and that's what the, uh, the things are for. Oh, yep. Okay. Um. Oh, this looks kind of tough. Come on. Oh, geez, like this actually does look tough. They're, they're making me work for this. Oh, I almost fell. Is this the is this the last one? Nice. Oh, and of course I go all the way back up. I should have known there's a little pedestal up there. Oh, this is such a cool sub area. Like this is insane. Like, you got the, like, ruins in the background from Ruin Kingdom, but it's, like, a cloud in, in the sky sort of vibe. I don't know. Like, it's just such a cool area. Like, I have no idea where this skybox comes from either. I, I don't recognize this from anywhere else in the game. Like, I feel like it has to just be Cloud Kingdom, but it doesn't feel like Cloud Kingdom. So there's moon shards. Uh, let's keep going up. Let's kill you. Oh, I, I gotta be careful. Wait, no, I, I healed. I healed. We're fine. If I take one damage, it's not a not a huge deal. And got him. Kind of disappointed I didn't get a moon for that. This is so cool. Oh, and there's like a little ruins. Oh, and there's the ship in the background too. Wait, do we get to go on the ship? I think we do. Uh, how do I get up there? Because I don't think this goes high enough. I think we might need to find a different Paragoomba to get up here. Ooh, I see, um, I see another moon shard though. Let's go grab this real quick. <laughs> I like the little Shavarian hanging out down there. Do you have anything to say? Oh, we're scaring him. No, nothing to say. Let's check down here. I don't want to go too low, because... Ooh! I think we found another moon. All right. Below ruins. Nice. So that is two moons in this area. There's probably five. I already guess. It's a pipe. Uh, we're not gonna go in that yet because I don't know where it leads. Uh, what did that just do? Oh, I don't think this was here before. Oh, this is this is kind of tricky. Oh no, I I got it. I got it. Oh. You Okay. Uh, okay. Keep going. Jump. This is really cool. All right, I gotta make it. Come on, and there we go. Nice, back to the roots. I like that moon, that's really cute. Like it just, it fits with the theme of the level so well. anything in here uh, oh I think there I think I remember seeing a moon shard up here as we were climbing up
free. Oh, it's so tempting to jump on that. Please don't kill me. Please let me stand on you. Okay. Uh, oh no. I feel like I could spin my hat on the top of this. It just feels like you could. No, I can't. Unfortunate. Uh, is there anything down here? Oh, okay, there is. We need one more shard. I feel like it's gonna be on that ship. gotta climb my way back up. This is taking forever. Let's keep going, Mario. We're almost there. We're almost there. Alright. Uh, I guess I can go in the pipe. Oh, I'm just nervous. I don't want it to take me out of the level. Okay, that that scared me. I wait, am I upside down? What? What? <laughs> Excuse me, that's so cool. <laughs> that is so cool. I'm just suddenly upside down. Oh my gosh, this is so weird. <laughs> like, yeah, you can see you can see where we just were. Alright, I don't think that's where we're supposed to go. I think we're supposed to go this way. Oh my gosh, did they really like design the level so that you could play back through it going upside down? Like, that's just ridiculous. Even the even the Goombas are upside down. Well, not like literally upside down, but like you you know what I mean. They're just they're just floating there. Alright. Oh, I almost fell there. Alright, we made it back up. The sky upside down. Oh, can we just take a moment to like look back at this? Oh, that's so cool. I am just constantly getting blown away here. Alright, uh, we are, I think, back at the beginning of the level? Oh, that would explain why the platform was there. All right, uh, so we're missing one moon in this area and it's from the last moon shard. And I'm pretty sure I saw the moon shard on the ship. So we gotta figure out how to get up there. I think I have an idea of how I could potentially do it. We just gotta get a Paragoomba like really high up. And then once we do that, um, it should be really easy to get on the ship. Um, which Paragoomba do I want to use? Uh, I think what we can do is we can fly a Paragoomba over there and like bring it up using the platforms. And then we can fly it over to the ship. I think that's, that's the plan. So I'm going to grab this guy right up here. Let's fly him over, because he's not quite high enough to reach that yet. But if we take him on this, I think we'll be high enough. Yep, 
Yeah, that's perfect. Ship is cool. It feels like something from Galaxy. Like, it honestly might be. Wait, what? Where's the moon? It's... Um, I really hope I don't have to jump to my death to get that. Uh, all right, let's let's get back to the beginning because it was definitely down that way. Oh, there it is. Okay, it was just it was just a bug with the camera. I was I was worried. I'm glad that worked. All right. Um, that should be all the moons in this area. And I'm pretty sure I can just jump out. I think this is an above the clouds area. Yeah, it is. I was honestly throughout all of that really afraid of falling for that reason. All right, we have one sub area left to give a try. And after that last one, I think this one's gonna be like it. I, I, I am constantly getting blown away by this mod. Whoops, ow. So I feel like it's gonna be a cool one. Oh no, I'm not gonna make this. Let's try that again. We are up at the top. Let's let's see what the last sub area is like. Okay. This is neat. Can I go in this pipe? No. That looks breakable. Uh, can I go anywhere with these guys? Something back here? Ooh, this looks like a moon. I'm gonna I'm gonna be patient here. Wait till it's back up and jump. All right, what's back here? It's gotta be a moon, right? Just keeps going. This area is so big. Oh. I feel like I'm in a maze right now. Maybe it is a maze. Wait, is that a moon glow? No. I guess up more. I saw a lava thing here. I can definitely make it up to there, but I don't know if that's where I'm supposed to be or not. <laughs> Man, there's so much in this area. What the heck? Yeah, I can't tell if I'm lost in a maze right now or this is where I was supposed to go. Uh, I think we're just gonna try and go up onto the wall here. Okay, this is cool. This is really cool. We've got moon shards. Are there any other like moon shards over here? Or is it just the one? Break the boxes? I can't. 
Oh, there's a path this way. Oh, all right. I think this is where we were supposed to get with the uh, the fire bro or the lava, the potaboo, the potaboo. <laughs> get out of the way, dragons. All right, uh, I guess we can take the exit pipe. I feel like we got everything we needed to over there. We found the one moon shard and the, um, the thing, the moon. I wonder, like, does this do anything if you stand on this? No? Okay, I'm I'm just overthinking it. <laughs> uh, I don't think I'm supposed to be back here. Go back, go back. Where was I? All right, let's go on, let's go into the castle. Oh, but there's so many ways to go. I like I, I keep saying like, oh, let's go here. But then I see like, oh, I could go here instead. I'm afraid if I. Well, there's not. Is there anything I can get in here? Or is it just a little circle? Okay, it's just a little circle. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna hit the uh the block. It couldn't be anything, I think. It'd be funny if it was something. Oh, there's more lava? Dude, there's just so much. I feel like I'm in like a lava like maze. Is that like a volcano? That's so cool. <laughs> Dude, look at this. This is so impressive. Like, this is like one guy made this. <laughs> it's a sub area too, that's true. All right, we found another moon shard. I think, I think that's all we had to get over here was the moon shard. So let's head back this way. Wrong way. I'm lost. I keep getting lost. I'm really good at that. shard. Alright, it might be about time to try and head towards that castle, if I can find it. Um, there it is. It's so much easier to see where things are if I just climb up. Wait, what? Chat, we can climb the volcano? Oh, I didn't even notice that. Here, we gotta, we gotta go back. I didn't even notice. That's so cool. We're, we're, we're holding off going to the castle. I know I keep saying we'll go to the castle, but I want to climb the volcano. I'm sorry. This is just too cool. we go oh and we get glide on up here <laughs> yo here get that with a down throw i want to i want to be able to fly with glide on we don't want to we don't want to have to climb back up all right where where do we go we can go like anywhere this is probably a bad idea though <laughs> I don't think we're supposed to be in this part of the map. This is so cool to fly around in, though. Oh, wait, can I make it to the ship? 
Uh, nice. I don't know if we're even supposed to be up here. Oh, we are! Let's go! Moon number two, Axum Rangers unit. I don't know what that means. I feel like it's a reference. It's like, this looks like something, but I don't know what it is. Just a, just a guy, I guess. All right, I am completely lost again. Uh, it looks like this way is the castle. So let's finally go to the castle. Is this the castle? <laughs> that looks like a boss arena if I've ever seen one, chat. I don't know if it is. Here, we should use the front gate. Be, be polite. Oh, maybe it's not a boss arena. <laughs> um, all right, the moon's somewhere in that direction. The, the camera doesn't seem like it's been doing it right when I've um finished the moon shards. So we might have to do a little bit of looking. This area is so cool though. Yeah, what what a difficult boss that was. Ooh, a cave. Uh we will wait to go in that pipe. That might have even been where we came in. Oh yeah, I think it was. Uh so where did that moon spawn? It was like somewhere over here. I am completely lost. I don't even remember where the- Oh, is that it? Nice. All right, I think- So that's our fourth moon, right? I think we need one more. There should be one more in this area. And it looks like it would be right here. But I don't know how to get in there. Maybe I can find another way in. Try that pipe too. Lava bubble? I don't think the lava bubble will break it. I mean, I'll, I'll try. Yeah, and this was the entrance pipe. Because this is where we started, right? Yeah. going for the pipe in a moment. I think it's the way out. Um, it does look like there's supposed to be a boss fight where the uh, the arena is. But I, I think it's not spawning. I think that is the last moon. So let's go back that way and see if it's here now. Uh, no. <laughs> oh, that's from... What do you call it? What game is that? I don't remember. Uh, here, let me try loading a different save. Probably won't work. Mario Part RPG. Yeah! Yeah!
Did I crash the game by loading a different save? That save might be broken. Um, I can try loading a different profile. Maybe. Because I think the issue is, chat, there's supposed to be a boss there, but it's not spawning. Uh, does the dangers profile have something? And I, I want to I wanna end with the boss fight, you know? If it doesn't work, I can re-download a different version of the mod. Or I can download a, like, post-game save file. Super Mario Odyssey post-game save file. Oh, this one might work. Actually, this one will probably work better. All right, this one, this one will work, hopefully. Um, we will just wear this. We gotta look nice for the boss fight. Wait, wrong way. It's over here. Right? Yeah. I don't think we're going to make it up in time. Oh, just barely. Okay. Is she here? No, where's the boss fight? <laughs> Heck. All right, here, let me, let me re-download the mod chat. But a different version of it, because it might, maybe this version just doesn't have the boss. All right, um, ba ba ba. All right, let's download this version and hope this version has it fixed. How many times have I re-downloaded the mod? This is the second time. I mean, it's... Chat, when you make a mod of this scale, it's hard to not have things break. I'll just put it like that. And also, I'm playing on, like, a weird save file, I guess. Wait, did I download the right version of the mod? I don't think I did. Yeah, I did not. Whoops.
It'd be funny if this fixed the peach crash too. Yeah, hopefully Madame Brutal's there in this version. Cause like I'm I'm looking at the mod page. Um And there's definitely a boss fight in that area. All right, let's put this in here. All right, well, that's installing. I'm going to go to the bathroom real quick. And then once I'm back, hopefully it fixes it. And if not, we'll just we'll move on to a different a little different little mod because there's a few others I want to try that I haven't I haven't done. So I'll be right back. All right, chat, I'm back. Also, yeah, if, if this ends up being a video, I think I'll edit it myself. I don't want to have to bother my editor to be like, oh, uh, edit around this, and this is how I want this thing to be, and all these other weird specifics. Like, I know they can work around it, but there's just a lot of other stuff I need to have them editing anyway. So if there's like a video I should edit myself, I think it should be this one. Because <laughs> I think I, I think out of all the stuff I want to give to my editor, I think one of them I should edit myself. Because they like, you know, they, they only have so much time to, to work on my stuff because they have to work on other stuff for other people. Also, I really hope we can get the boss fight to spawn, because if not, it's going to be really awkward ending the video. It's going to be really awkward. Uh, hi. Na <laughs> Naomi, I probably said that wrong, but yeah, I, I can say that. I got an HBO Max promotional email saying that they're changing HBO Max to just be called Max. Why? Why? <laughs> That's so... Companies are so wild. Like, I know you have to do, like, some level of modernization when it comes to, like, your product. But this just seems discovery. 
or this just seems stupid. Uh, they merge with Discovery. But even if they merge with Discovery, I feel like calling it HBO Discovery sounds better than just calling it Max. Or Discovery Max. Why just make it Max? Like if you if it's because of the merger. <laughs> so so dumb. It's like calling Disney Plus Plus. You know you're right. <laughs> Alright, is the is it almost installed? 26 files left, but I think a lot of the last files go pretty quickly. So it's probably almost done. So Max and why are they talking about them? Because HBO Max is rebranding to Max. All right, 24 files left. I'm crossing my fingers, chat, that we're going to go into the, the game and um, it's the boss is going to work. <laughs> I am praying. Well, I don't think the the name itself being like short is a problem. Like or being somebody's name. I just think Max is a bad progression for the brand. It's like if Discord rebranded their entire company to being Nitro. Like, I feel like that's just a bad progression. Super Mario Odyssey! Well, I don't think the name needs to necessarily identify what the brand is, but oh well. All right, uh, we're gonna be back in game. Hopefully this works. We are on an older version of the mod now. <laughs> oh, that was close. All right. No, she's still not here. <laughs> All right, well, um, yeah, I was looking at the mod page and this is definitely the last moon. There's supposed to be a Madame Brutal boss fight here, but it is just not here. So <laughs> I guess we're done with the mod, which really cool mod. A shame we couldn't end it on like a boss fight because this is a super sweet arena. But, um, oh, this, this mod has just been so cool. Shout outs, shout outs again to, um, uh, what's their name? What's their name? What's their name? Frick, 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 frick. Shout outs again to Skydorm1 for making this mod. This is genuinely one of like the most impressive SMO mods I have ever played in spite of like the like issues. Like, it's so cool. Just like, look at this. It's phenomenal. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, please subscribe and I'll see you later. All right, um, that might work for an outro. <laughs> well, I'll figure that out if I, if I start editing this video. <laughs> um, 
All right, chat. There's still some other custom levels I want to give a try. Uh, this next one I don't think has any moons in it, but I just want to look at it because it looks neat. It's a port of one of the Paper Mario levels. Um, I don't know if it has moons in it or not. I think it's by the same person. It is by the same person, so I can I don't even have to change the thing. But um. Will this be on a YouTube video? Well, uh, this mod might be, but not the mod I'm going to. But yeah, the same, the same person, Skydorm, made a port of Toad Town in Paper Mario Origami King. Which, yeah, I guess that tracks, um, because the mod we were... Um, just playing had a lot of Paper Mario in like Mario RPG references in it. So yeah, the guy's definitely a Paper Mario fan. Well, actually, I don't know if they're a guy. So my bad if they are not. All right, chat. The downside is we have to go through a process of installing another mod, but I don't think this one will take as long. Toad Town by Skydorm1. Um, what kingdom is it in? Um, so it should be Cascade Kingdom. Which makes sense. Most mods replace Cascade Kingdom. Chat, my door just moved a little bit. Yeah, this is... That's actually crazy. So the mod we're about to load into, chat, says it's their, this is their first SMO mod. And it was like three months ago. So from the looks of it, the last kingdom we just played, they made in like a month, and it was, and it was like their second SMO mod. <laughs> what the heck? They probably have experience modding other games, would be my guess. Yeah, the timeline is Paper Mar the Paper Mario Origami King level was three months ago, and Bon Bon Mountain was, t or Bon Bones Mountain was two months ago. So, probably a bit over a month or something. That's crazy. I mean, in fairness, I think... I think Autumn Isles was one of Cupcake's first Odyssey mods. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe they did a lot of private commission work before that, but... It's Bon Bone Mountain. Also, Raven God, thank you for the tier one. Time Modder made that in a month. Well, I don't think it's their first mod with, like, in general. Yeah, so the Origami King was January, like, 3rd, it looks like. Yeah, was January 3rd, and what was Bond Bones? February 25th, so it was more like two months. It was like two months of work for that last mod we just played. Some of the best mess of mods you've seen? Yeah, for sure. Like, there's a reason... I really want to make a video out of it because it's so cool. Like, it's just a really cool mod. Like, I think I'm going to do everything I can to turn that into a video. As hard as it ends up being to, like, edit around stuff. All right. 
So this next mod should replace Cascade. Oh, it crashed. All right, maybe I can't do this mod. <laughs> Did I forget to uninstall anything? All right, chat. We might have to. We might have to do a different mod. Which is fine. Alright, what was the other mod I wanted to try? There was like one more. I think it was... I think I wanted to do ZPLs. I think I wanted to do ZPLs, um... Because I never played the back half of the Kingdom Pass. I played through the first few levels in the Kingdom Pass, but I never did the, like, the last few. Let me, let me see. Yeah, so I did up to the spooky level. I never did the, f like, last, like, two levels in it. Um, so I'm going to download Kingdom Pass Final, and we're going to do the, um, we're going to do that mod. Man, chat, this is going to suck so much to make into a VOD channel upload. I'm going to have to actually... <laughs> What's going to happen is I'm going to have to go through the, um, the VOD and, like, cut out all these sections where we're just, like, at this screen downloading stuff. But, hey, at least we get to talk. And I can turn on elevator music, too. Ghost one is the best of the ZPL ones. That's fair. I think, like, my opinion on the ZPL maps is I think they're really, like, it's a really good first set of SMO maps. Because, like, they're really visually pleasing, but there's not, like, a ton of points of interest, I guess. Like, I think that this is my opinion I think I gave on the ZPL maps the last time I played them. They're really cool looking but like they can be hard to like find your way around and it like they don't feel like as odyssey like specific i guess Like, Autumn Isles, like, let's, if we compare it to Autumn Isles, like, Autumn Isles is, like, pretty easy to find your way around. Like, it's not, like, super crazy in the visual department. Like, the aesthetic style Cupcake took on it was, like, pretty straightforward and simple, which is good. But, like, all the challenges in the level are really well designed because, um, Cupcake just has a good understanding of, like, Odyssey and is pretty decent at the game, too. But with um, the, with the ZPL map, like it's a very visually pleasing map. But I feel like there's not a ton of stuff that are like super Odyssey specific challenges, if that makes sense. The moons are relatively standard, but the scenery is awesome. Yeah. Like the Kingdom Pass is a visually pleasing mod, but it. It doesn't have like that Odyssey flair, I guess. Yeah, ZPL does Mario Kart stuff. So like they already, they know how to make visually pleasing mods. Is there anything I'd want to see in a mod? I would want to see more stuff like the last mod I just played. But again, the last mod I just played, I think was 250 hours of work. Cause out, so, out of the custom kingdoms I played in SMO, I think the top two are Autumn Isles and Bon Bones Kingdom. Or Bon Bones Desert, whatever it was called. I think those are the best two Odyssey custom maps I've played. Because, like, I love Autumn Isles, and that last map is really cool. Um, what are some other good ones? Well, I guess some some of the stuff Amethyst made that she never released is pretty decent. 
Like, I don't think Amethyst ever released her Bianco Hills, and that's like a really solid port of Bianco Hills. Uh, I play Scarlet and Violet sometimes. She never released it. Um, I think it never made it from the point of being like almost done to like done and releasing it. Did I ever play Mario Kart with viewers? Uh, that'd be decent during a subathon, I think. All right, yeah, I think what we'll do is we'll do the ZPL maps I never played. Uh, hopefully I can just load 100% save so we don't have to start from the beginning. Or we could just start from the beginning because I know ZPL made some changes to the levels. Am I doing a subathon soon? Probably not. So, I go on vacation at the start of the next month. And also, it turns out <laughs> I'm going to be gone at the end of this month too for a few days. Because I got invited to something. I don't know if I'm allowed to talk about it yet. Um, you guys will know what it is at some point, though. Um, because of, like, the nature of it. Like, like I have an obligation to tell you about it. I just don't want to say anything before I'm supposed to say anything, right? Because I don't want to, you know, get in trouble. So hide and seek IRL. No, it's it's a it's it's a collaboration with a uh, a company. I think that's the best way to put it. Without like saying anything, I'm, I wouldn't be allowed to say yet. Yeah, it should be it should be cool. Um. And there's like a 90% chance it's happening at this point. Is Pooh playing the Binding of Isaac now too? Guys, I can't tell you what it is. Yet, I think. I'll, I'll ask after stream if I'm allowed to when I'm allowed to talk about it, because I, I know you guys would be curious. Yeah, we're just waiting to install the next the next mod. This is the downside of doing custom custom kingdom streams. Oh yeah, I don't know if these will end up turning to videos chat, but somebody made a collect moon jump higher mod that we might do at some point. And somebody else also made a flooded SMO mod, which we might do at some point. How are the custom apps? We're doing another one. It's just taking a bit to download because it's a big file. We're doing we're doing Kingdom Pass again, but there's been an update since I've last played it, so I'm gonna play it again. Oh yeah, somebody made a um, SMO, but the world is flooded. I, I think it was a request from Hubie. Uh, if you remember, they're the German SMO YouTuber. And funnily enough, chat, the flooded SMO mod is made by the same person who made the mod we just played. <laughs> I think it was a request from Hubie to, um, to um, what's their name again? Uh, Skydorm. Didn't Smant play that a while ago? I think Smant played something like that, but I think it was different. So request not a commission? Uh, I don't know the details. I just read somewhere on the mod page that it was a request. Oh yeah, I should upload, I should update the current command. Uh, 
Where is the mod so I can add it linked? How many mods can Skyrim squeeze out in three months? I don't know, but I hope they keep making stuff. Whenever somebody starts making really cool things in SMO modding, I want them to keep making stuff. One of the reasons is because when people make stuff that I don't commission, I can make a video without having to pay for a mod. Um, that doesn't mean I'm not willing to pay people. It just means like... Like it's nice when I don't have to come up with an idea and then pay somebody to make that idea in that whole process. Um, like the flood mod was really cool. It also gives me a chance to potentially network with people that I could eventually pay to make stuff. Like I really wanna pay the person who made the flood mod to make another power up. But I don't know what. Um, I want to do Sunshine Hide and Seek. Like, that's actually something that might happen at some point. Um, like, I, I've i talked with the mod maker a little bit. But that's something that keeps getting pushed back, basically. So, maybe one of these days we will do Super Mario Sunshine Hide and Seek. Um, but... Scheduling and actually getting something like that planned is hard. All right, chat, there's only eight more queued files left. We are almost done installing Kingdom Pass. Yeah, I mean, making a multiplayer mod is hard. And I feel like with mods, the larger scale the mod, the more likely it is to get taken down. Like, I would love to try and organize a Super Mario Odyssey 2 mod collaboration where it's like a ton of super high quality kingdoms put together. But I don't really think that's realistic because it will probably just get taken down by Nintendo and that would mean people would spend a lot of work and I'd potentially be spending a lot of money to... Um, get something like that done. Well, I just think that would be like a really cool project. Like I wouldn't even, like it wouldn't necessarily be something I'd want to commission. Uh, we're just going to double check that the moons work first um, now that we're in the game. I mean, I wouldn't necessarily want to be something I'd want to commission, but I think it'd be really cool to organize a project like that and then just, like, release it um, for anyone to play. So, like, I wouldn't have any exclusivity. All right, we're going to go into this kingdom, and we're going to see if the moons aren't collected, and if they aren't, we can play. So let me turn off the music. All right, let's see if this works. I like the Animal Crossing music. Um, all right, I just gotta find a moon and if it's, okay, okay, we're good. So this is the newest addition to ZPL's Kingdom Pass and I have not tried it yet. Uh, I have no clue how many moons there are. Can I can I get that information somehow? Oh wait, do you have the moon list? Oh, I think you do. Do you? I don't know if these kingdoms are actually gonna have 40 moons or not. <laughs> That's a lot. It looks pretty. It does. Like th this is like I was saying earlier. Like all of ZPL's custom kingdoms are very pretty. Winter? Wait, can you change the time? Wait, 
Oh, there's... I think you can. I mean, an Animal Crossing themed map, I feel like changing the time makes sense. Yeah, that's so cool. Oh, it's a different time of day, too. I love that. That is so cool. Yeah, this is this is honestly like I I think I think as a, a map maker what ZPL excels at is just making things look pretty. So it looks like the main challenge here, I think, is we have to find moons in the kingdom for like the right time of the year. Yeah, because, like, that's summer. So whenever we're in the wrong version, it will show us. Okay, that, that's neat. So it's like, we're basically doing, like, a little scavenger hunt in an Animal Crossing town. Is there any music right now, chat? Because I can turn on some music if there's not. No music. All right, let's turn on some tunes. Let's make it some, uh, let's do, where's the button? Let's do some relaxing music. Oh, I see another moon. elevator music? I don't know if I'd personally call this elevator music. Got a spring and a winter moon over here. I think we might change the time again. I, I mean, I'm sure there's definitely more fall moons to find, though. I guess that's the hard part, right? Here, let's change let's change the time. Where do we have to go again? I think this is probably the winter pipe. Oh, okay. We got in-game music now, it sounds like. So I can turn that off. It's it's so much spookier now. Alright, rooftop run. The small rocks treasure. Honestly, this is neat. Just like a little it's like a little just scavenger hunt level. In a little, little animal crossing village. I just realized we're on an island too, just, just like an animal crossing. Oh, there's some shards up here. Top shards. Maybe we maybe we change the date again. 
seven of 24 moons. I'm starting to think 24 is accurate. Maybe six in each season. That would make sense. I haven't been doing a good job of keeping track, which I found in each season, but maybe they're like ordered that way on the moon list. I feel like that makes sense. Spring! Wait, let me check. So this would hypothetically be one month, and this would be one month. Oh yeah, and then this would be one month, and then this would be, oh, I think they are ordered. Oh, here, let's do some peppier music for, for spring. Okay, yeah, so let's, let's grab this. It's dancing on the parasol. Yeah, okay, they are, so we can actually figure out what season we're missing moons in. That is very convenient. Because honestly, this was probably going to suck if that's not how it works. <laughs> I don't think I would have found all the moons. I think there was a spring one on the beach, I remember. Uh, so let's go, let's go onto the beach. Just a very big beach. Any flowering trees in your guys' area? Uh, I have no idea. I don't really pay attention. <laughs> There's definitely one on the beach for spring. Oh, I think there might be one on the beach for every month. Because there, there's two fall. There's another summer. I think we're going to do a need. We need to do a trip around the beach for every, every season. Chilling in the shade. All right, yeah, I think that might be the only spring one on the beach. Because I think we've already been here before. All right, good to know. How many more spring moons do we need? Um, I forget which number was spring was. Is EPL in chat? Oh, wait, no, we're just saying ZPL made the mod. <laughs> Alright, chat, yell if you see any moons. I don't really care if you guys backseat. Because it's basically just a, a scavenger hunt. Cherry blossom trees. Yeah, okay, so we need... Three more moons. Yeah, I'm, I'm all right with backseating on this one just because of like the nature of it. I think I think it's just better because we're basically just running around looking for stuff. Oh, hey, there's a little old guy. This might be a moon. It might be two moons. No. <laughs> Say check the big tree. I don't know if there's really a way to get up there. Oh, okay, there's a Goomba stack moon. Let's not for, oh wait, they're just right here. The music, there's not double music, is there? 
All right. Um, so we need one more. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Yeah, we should be finding one more Spring Moon. All right, Chad, if you see a moon, make sure to yell, okay? <gasps> there it is! We are done with spring! All right, let's go back to um, summer. I think summer is the first set. And I think this had music. Yeah. You can just listen to the game music. I think there were two on the beach, so we're just gonna do a lap around the beach. You want to go to the beach? I'll be honest, I've never been much of a beach guy. I think beaches are pretty. Like, I wouldn't mind living on a beach, but I don't really want to get in the sand or the water. I think that's sort of like how I exist. Wait, was there a Goomba stack there? No. There are rocky beaches too. I would fall and hurt myself. But yeah, I think I think I personally wouldn't mind existing near a beach. But that's like the extent. I think we're done with the beach moons. I'm just gonna keep going for a little bit. Yeah, we should be good. All right, chat, keep an eye out for moons. Sand isn't super fun to deal with. Yeah, it really isn't. Back porch. Alright, just one more. Donna, I think a, almost a sweep around the outside of the town. So if it's not here, you should probably go on to the inside part of the town. Yeah, 
Yeah, I think it's probably somewhere on the inside. Yeah. Oh, there it is. We found it. Right, here we go. All right, so we've done those two pipes. Uh, I guess we can do fall next. And we'll get some chill music back on. Yeah, this is good fall music. Um, I think there are two on the beach we need to get. So we're gonna do our lap around the beach. No, I haven't done this in the past. I know others have. Uh, I did the other ZPL maps though, so it might, you might recognize it from that. Ba -da -da -dum. Yo, Alicia, thank you for the tier one. I appreciate it. Here's one of them. All right, I think there's one more. Can I pass it? Passed it, or maybe I already got it. Did you shower? I mean, you should shower at some point. Yeah, this is where we started. So if there's another one on the beach, we missed it. check with your phone guide or whatever. Oh, 
So we still need like a few. We need three. I'm worried I did miss one on the beach. Which I really don't want to um, go back around the beach. All right, I think we've already seen that one. So let's start going more inside. Ba -da 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 -da. Oh, I see one. Yeah, there's the one by the Odyssey that I missed. Oh, I see one. No, wait, that was just light. Act up. Maybe there is one in the tree. No, it doesn't look like it. I don't think I'm supposed to be up here. Oh, wow, you can stand on that. That's funny. All right, I don't know. I don't know how much longer I'm going to look for these moons, chat. It's like sometimes when you're, it's like when you're doing an Easter egg hunt and there's like a few eggs left and you know there's a few eggs left, but you don't want to find them. <laughs> Cause we're missing, we're missing four eggs. To keep with the analogy. Yeah, I think we I think I might just go to the next kingdom. Are all four here? No, two are in this one and two are in the next one. Actually, one is in this one and then three are in the next one we can we can do winter and i think i might just leave the one in fall i think we might we might take the one egg in fall as just an acceptable loss all right there should i think i think there's two on the beach here So let's see. Yeah, here's one. Uh, do we want to find that one we're missing in fall? I don't know if I do. I keep thinking about it. Yo, Cal, thank you for the tier one. I appreciate it. There another one. Did I make the full loop? Is this where I think I am? Yeah, I did. 
All right, uh, let's see if I can find the last two in this area. Again, chat, remember, yell if you see anything. There's one. Middle of the neighborhood. So it's just one more in winter. Two, two moons left in total, one in this area. If I can't find it soon, I might just not look for it. I think is valid. Honestly, there's the one moon left in fall. I'm not getting it. <laughs> I don't care enough. We're just going to leave that one. Then Ice Cream Kingdom. Give me a second. I need to take off my jacket. No music again, so we do this. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. How many moons here? It says 40. Wait, yeah, that said 40, right? Yeah, uh, that's a lot. But I guess a lot of them are just gonna be like this, where it's just like, oh, there's a moon right here. I mean, that really, that really is what it is. They're just like, oh, there's a moon. I'm like, oh, there's another moon. Like we were talking earlier, I feel like the ZPL maps are like, they're basically like scavenger hunts. It's like the map looks pretty uh, and the moons are sort of just like hidden throughout the map, just sort of forever. Like, they're not very complicated. Like, oh, four Goombas were right next to the Goombas. Those moon shards are just right there.
Alright. Song is good? I agree. I like Kirby music. We have like three moons in our view right now. another right there okay I'm starting to wonder how are there 40 mo oh okay because there's one here but still I, I feel like how are there 40 moons I feel like I'm running low already maybe there's a sub area oh true I, there might be a sub area Oh uh, yeah, we did do hide and seek on uh, custom maps by ZPL once. I'm pretty sure that's part of the reason why there's a bench on every stage and I think it's funny. What if I jump down here? Okay, that's what I expected to happen, but sometimes you just gotta try, right? A little loud car. You did the notes. Each big slice of cake has a moon near it. I think I've gotten most of those. I know for sure I'm missing moons, but I don't know how many I'm actually missing. Because we haven't gotten a moon past 17, so there might only be like 17 or 18 moons. Ooh, here's one. Sneaky. Yeah, I think, I think we assume I'm missing one moon and there's only 16 moons. And that the, um... The number on the moon list is just bugged. Oh, I thought I could wall jump on that. Oh, no. Oh, I think that's the, the moon we're missing. There's a ground pound up here. Yeah! Alright, I think... Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's all the moons. I think the moon list is just bugged and there's only 17. Yeah, yeah, okay. There are 17 moons, so... We got them! Let's go! We just have Retro Kingdom left. Well, no, it's not impossible, Hamish. It's just I'm playing out of a post-game save file. Because I've already done the first half of this mod. All right, does this one have music? Yeah, it does. Oh, is that Maple Tree Way? I love that. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, this is cute. I missed what the heck. Should I talk to Toad and see how many moons there are? Oh, you're right. I should. Twelve moons, six in each part. Okay. So I think there's a pipe that was by the Odyssey that we can go into once we find the six in this area. We've already found... Three of them. I just need to grab the third here. Yeah, I, I'm aware of ZPL those custom uh, custom Mario Kart tracks. Here's five. All right, just one more, and then we can go through the pipe. So let's get like a vantage. See anything? I mean, we could just roll through the track and see if I find anything. Oh, wait. No. Oh, I can't even go in there. That's disappointing. There's a tree in the way of the shortcut. What the heck? Oh, I think we found it. That is hidden in there. All right, into the sub area. <laughs> oh, oh, there's one. Hey, we got moon shards. I feel like that's fitting in like a race car themed track. You know, make me make me go through the track. Did I get a prize for coming in second in the race? Maybe. I don't think they'll be very hard to find. <laughs> yeah, I, I found one of them already. Then we've got Goomba stacking. I'll just start stacking them now. But I already see it over there. Six. Easy enough. There's like 50 Goombas on the stage. Nice. All right, and that is all the moons. All right, I have officially beaten all the stages in ZPL's custom, uh, whatever you want to call it. Uh, the, uh, the Kingdom Pass, I couldn't remember the name. All right, now I want to run out here and see, <laughs> see what's out here. Except that one full moon. Yeah, but I'm not getting that moon. Heck it. Off we go! Is there a death plane? 
Wait, music started playing. What the heck? Was that not playing before? <laughs> Was that not playing before? <laughs> That's, that's funny. All right, well, uh, we're stuck. So I think, I think that's a good spot to end it. Cause there, I really only wanted to do the new ZPL maps, which are like months old at this point, And the, um, the what, the map we did earlier. I mean, the main thing I wanted to do was the map we did earlier, which that one will probably be a video. Uh, I think I'm gonna try and edit it into one at least. Oh my gosh. All right, well, um, I think that is going to be the stream then, chat. So, uh, I hope, hope you enjoyed. Um, yeah, I'm just, I'm just double checking if there isn't anything else I want to do. Like, there's, there's a port, like, of Lethal Level, Lethal Lava Land. But I don't really care to do that. There's also like a first map somebody made that says getting over it with Mario Odyssey. Um, I don't really want to try that much either. Cause I know that one's just like a first sub area somebody made. So yeah, um, we'll raid somebody. If Sman's streaming, I can raid Sman cause he, he was nice and I got to do the, the cool mod with him yesterday. So we can read man. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, I think I'm going to go work on um, the video for the first mod we did today. Because I, I want to make it a video. I think that's a really, really cool custom map. I think it would be a really cool video. Like, I, I want people to see it. I just need to figure out how to edit around the jank, you know? So yeah, I think I think I might work on that tonight. I will see you guys later. Give Smant some love. Bye.